Hello and welcome to UA Tips for you. So we are working on our climbing system tutorial series and in our last tutorial we have set up this functionality to our character that our character can jump in any direction if there is some valid spot like if there is some valid patch or hole is detected then our character can jump to that particular location as you guys can see my character can properly move to the ledges or holes and in this tutorial we will set up the proper hang to jump animations functionality so that our character can properly perform the required animation that are necessary for performing the hang to jump animation so let's get started guys so first I'm gonna open my animation blueprint and here is my climbing state machine and when I enter the state machine I perform the idle to braced hang animation and instead of performing idle to braced hang I'm I'm gonna connect my entry state to hang idle state and disconnect this state and we will perform the idle to braced hang animation by using animation montage so now let's open our content browser and here is my idle to braced hang animation I'm gonna right click and create animation montage like so and set the default store a uh, default slot to climb upslope that we have set up in our previous tutorials so here is our idle to base to hang animation mode on setup and when I press spacebar and before set before move component to the particular location I'm gonna play my play any mode on over here like so and after this I'm gonna set can hang to true like so now I'm gonna open my animation blueprint and here is my animation graph and in our locomotion state machine I'm gonna right click and search for default slot and set the slot name to climb up slot like so so when we are in our locomotion state we will perform idle to braced hang animation and after performing the animation montage we will set up the can hang variable true and after that we are in our climbing state machine or in our climbing state so here you guys can see I have the exact same functionality like previously but now we do this with with the help of animation montage so now I'm gonna open content browser and here are my hang to jump left and write animations that I have downloaded from Mixamo and I have applied no changes on it it's just the basic animation that I downloaded from the Mixamo and now we will export our animation and edit them using HIK rig in Maya and then we will use that animation for performing the hang to jump and you hang to jump in specific direction animations so I'm gonna export hang to jump right animation like so now I'm gonna open my scene 
So here is the HIK scene that we have set up in our previous tutorials in Maya. And now I'm gonna import the animation. So here is my hang to jump right animation. First I'm gonna go to the outliner and select the hips of the skeleton, SWAT skeleton and then go to the windows, animation editor and graph editor and I'm gonna select the x-axis of the hips and set this to 0. So by setting the x-axis to 0, you guys can see I have the proper in place hand to jump right animation. And then I'm gonna select the Z axis and by pressing middle mouse button and drag the entire curve to downward side like so. So here are the changes that we have needed for changing the animation result. Now I'm gonna go to my human IK and bake this to skeleton and then bake this to my control rig. So here is the animation. And we can change the animation using our HIK rig and adjust the pose according to our need. So for changing the animation pose, I'm gonna select all of my joints, go to the channel box and animation, create a new animation layer, select the animation layer and now we will change the animation according to our need so i'm gonna select my right hand and move it over here similarly my left hand and add the key by pressing s i'm gonna set key over here of my both hands So we just need the 32 frames of this animation, like so. And I think the remaining functionality is fine. Now I'm gonna add a key over here. So let's export the animation and check the animation result into Unreal Engine. I'm gonna select my hips ball and Go to File, Export Selection, and inside the Option menu, make sure you set check the Bake Animation, Start Frame to Zero, and End Frame to Thirty Two, like so. Now I'm gonna export the animation. Now we will import the animation into Unreal Engine. I'm gonna go to my directory. So here is the edited version of my animation that we have exported from Maya. So here is the required animation that we want for, for our hang to jump right. Now we will right click on the animation and create animation montage like so. 
open my mission montage and go to the slot animation slot manager create a new slot and call this hand to jump slot like so and in the default group I'm gonna set the slot name to hand to jump slot so here is the hang to jump right animation with proper slot is set up now we will open our animation blueprint and when our can hang is true we will add the default slot over here and the slot will be our hang to jump slot for performing the hang to jump right hang to jump right animation long dodge so we have set up this animation slot over here for performing hang to jump animation using animation long dodge so here is the required here is the required functionality that will move our capsule component to the particular location so I'm gonna create a sequence over here like so so all these previous functionality we have set up in our previous tutorial and in the first pin of sequence node I'm gonna play my animation montage and the montage will be this and the second pin will move my console component to the particular location so now let's check the result as you guys can see I have the proper hand to jump right animation with proper location and location location and rotation is set up Let's check this again. I think we should lower the hips a little bit more for grabbing the ledge properly. I'm gonna select my hips more into Maya and move move the hip a little bit lower like this and add the key over here similarly at the end position we are going to lower the hip and set the key over here now let's export the animation export selection and export our animation Open content browser, right click and we import the animation again. Now let's check the functionality again. Here you guys can see I have the proper hang to jump right animation is set up now. So now we will set up the hand to jump left animation. So I'm gonna go to the content browser and open my hang to jump left animation. So here is the hang to jump left animation that I have downloaded from Mixamo. Now I'm gonna export my animation. Open my HIK scene in Maya and then I'm gonna go to the channel box 
right click on animation there and delete the animation and so get set the source to none then we will import our animation hang to based hang hook left animation so here is our hang to jump left animation in our HIK scene so first thing first I'm gonna select my hip spawn go to the windows animation editor and graph editor select my x-axis and set this to 0 so here is the animation is now properly in place now I'm gonna select my z-axis grab all of my curve values and lower the curve by pressing middle mouse button according to our need so here is the z position is fine maybe a little bit more like so now we will go to the human IK bake bake to skeleton and then bake to control ray so here is our animation with proper HIK now I'm gonna select all of my joints go to the channel box and create a new animation layer on top of it so that we can edit the animation according to our need now I'm gonna select my right hand set it over here similarly for my right left hand and set the keys like so So here it perform a weird, weird rotation for my left arm. I'm gonna go to the frame nine, select my left arm, set the hand to lower like so, and set the key over here. So similarly for this animation we just need the 32 frames of the animation. So now let's export our animation. You can set the animation according to your need and change the animation poses as you guys want it. And in my case, I'm gonna export this. I'm gonna select my hip bone, go to File, Export Selection. And here is my paste hang of left animation. So now I'm gonna open my project and grab my paste hang of left animation into the project. So here is my hang to jump left animation that I have set up and applied the changing according to my need. Now I'm gonna right click and create an animation montage 
for my hand to jump left animation set the slot name to hand to jump slot that we have set up previously for our hand to jump right now I'm gonna open my event graph and for my animation montage I'm gonna right click and promote this to a variable and call this hang to jump montage so we just need to change this variable that which animation montage we gonna play according to the hang to jump direction and remaining functionality will be the same so for hang to jump right tracing if this is valid, we're gonna set the hang to jump montage to something like hang that we have set up this hang to jump right montage. Set this over here. So for my hang to jump left tracing, if this is valid, I'm gonna set the hang to jump montage to hang to jump montage like so. So we just need to set the set this variable for performing the hang to jump animation in specific direction and and all the main functionality will be the same. So now let's set the result over here. So I have I need to change the hang to jump right hang to jump left animation a little more I'm gonna delete the animation from here and set this again so here you guys can see I have this delay over here I'm gonna go to here and right click remove all my remaining frames like so so here is the required animation that we're gonna use for hang to jump right hang to jump left side now let's check the functionality again So you can change the animation according to your need. For example, here is the hang to jump right animation is properly set up. And you can also set up the hang to jump left according to your need. So in our next tutorial, we will set up the hang to jump upward and downward side functionality with proper animations. And then we will continue to the remaining tutorials for climbing system so i hope you guys like this video do subscribe my youtube channel and also you can support me on patreon and you guys can access all the project files and can communicate with me over patreon thank you guys